Hi, my name is Floyd Finch. I am the blogger at www.motorcycle.com. Normally, I write about motorcycles and do-it-yourself repairs and events. Occasionally, I do dabble in other subjects. One example is April of 2013. I did a report about the amount of pollution and trash strewn about a couple of local roads. One of those local roads is a state road running between Quinby and Florence, South Carolina. It's a little little dirt road just over a mile. At one end is Wilson High School and at the other end is Florence County Airport via Coppers Road. I was recently notified by the plant manager where I work that the county was considering repaving Coppers Road, which I think is a great thing. I would also like to encourage them to look at paving the state road. Due to our proximity with the CSX rail yard, it is not an unusual occurrence for the only main paved road leaving our facility at Safe Harbor Access Systems, the Coppers plant and postings is often blocked for up to two hours at the time by trains working in and out of the switching yard stopping across the tracks. A state road is often in such poor condition that employees are actually forced to wait until the train moves because if they're driving a normal sized car they have trouble navigating without getting stuck. My original blog post back in April of 2013 was also discussing the sheer volume of garbage that is dumped along this road. I do think paving the road will help prevent some of that. I would like to encourage everyone who hears this to contact your Florence representatives. If you live in Florence in this area or if you travel through this area or you work in this area and you would like to see them pave a state road while they are working on Coppers Road, Please let someone in power know. And I would also like to see the members of the local community come together and clean up the mess that other members of the local community have left down this road, degrading the environment. As you can see, watching my video, it's more than just trash. There are several television sets, mattresses, garbage, animal skeletons, construction debris, old furniture, and all manner of things that should have been disposed at at the county waste disposal site, which is located, I think, less than two miles from this road. At any rate, thank you for your consideration and for watching this video. Watch it all the way to the end. Just see the sheer amount of garbage that resembles more of a third world country than something you should see in the United States of America. And let's all work together. Hopefully, there could be a solution to this. And it would really be beneficial to pave this road if for no other reason due to the sheer amount of traffic that it sees each day which often doubles or triples at 5 o'clock or at 8 o'clock if the copper is crossing is blocked by a train. Thank you.